All right, everyone. Yeah, we're back with Glenn Velvet Reviews here. And uh, so, yeah, I ran. This is coming down from that box uh, that I, uh, you know, that I installed the the entrance, uh, the inlet box of the chameleon valve is right up there. I made the elbow. Put Remember, you got to use the, the, the sweep elbow that they make. And then uh, I ran it into there, obviously, put a clip in there to hold it to the to the ceiling because you don't want anything jiggling around. And then I have, if you notice the adapter, my adapter goes into two inch PVC pipe. I only did that um, because I have a very powerful vacuum and I wanted the larger diameter pipe. So if you get a, you know, two inch PVC pipe, it is very, you know, wide and it's uh, a little bit thicker. Um, and I got a very powerful um, central vacuum unit that we ordered. So that's the reason why I didn't mind, you know, using the adapters and going to the two inch. And plus it'll make the chameleon snake that we have, because you know the chameleon is supposed to go into the pipe. It's going to make it go into the pipe a lot easier if it has a larger diameter. So it's just going to suck it right in there. And that's kind of what's up on what I did. I used the, as you can see, a three inch. Uh, you, you're going to use whatever straps size that's going to fit your application obviously you know that's kind of it what you can expect on it going up then you know i glued it together um i used pvc glue i mean there's all different brands of pvc glue guys I, i'm not really uh one to name more one more than the other i mean i, I used od and i i used the other one that they have the one step i like that a lot uh the only reason i like the one step um, that I've been using is uh, I've had good results with the one step and I, I think I did a review on that I don't I don't remember um, But maybe I did uh, I try I try to do you know as many re um, Updates and reviews as I can uh, but the you know, there's only so many hours in a day um, And yeah, so it's going down and then I ran mine over and then that's where um, you know depending on your size of your chameleon hose guys obviously you're gonna have to run a longer line or a shorter line they have these up to 60 foot or 40 feet so you can have less or more than me i have in the middle so i needed a lot of leeway ran mine i snaked mine through my ceilings um obviously we need to seal all this up but uh as you see you know um you know obviously we have to you know seal all these up and re-spackle and i'll probably just put sheetrock up here and re-spackle that but we're gonna get to that the reason why i left it open a little bit longer though is because this is my first central vacuum install and first central vacuum ever that we've been using we have to do stuff cost efficient as possible and that's kind of what we did so that's why i left this open uh, you know other people would have just sealed it up but then they had a problem you, you know you got to open it back up and i just didn't want to go through all of that and i just want to do it right the first time because like i said i just don't have un unlimited you know funds to be thrown around and doing willy-nilly stuff right as you see uh, i came out it goes out obviously i used another adapter i had to use adapters over here and then i connected mine as you see all i don't i didn't even use 45s okay or just 90s and the reason why guys is because 90s are a killer 90 degrees have very high resistance okay um so i mean in anything hvac plumbing electrical any you, you name it a 90 degree always takes away from the volume of what you're trying to create you know what i mean it just does it's a it's a huge killer on that i didn't want to have 90s in here so i did get 245s but i figured you know what 245s this is a, my first chameleon i have the room if i didn't have the room i would have just did 245s but i had the room to do a long sweep and the longer the the longer the turn you do the less restriction the easier that chameleon's going to go through the less clogs you're going to end up having down the road you shouldn't really have clogs but i had the space to do it if you don't have the space then you're not going to do what i just did you're going to do it a little bit tighter and that's fine it's still going to work uh like i said in my videos i am a virgo so I I do stuff like this and it's just you know it's just my thing i can't do anything about it and, that, and then uh yes and then i pretty much ran it you know all the way down uh i ran the rest of the two inch pipe all the way down did the same exact thing uh you know all the way around and then so you could see there's the pipe the two inch so that runs all the way down and it's the same exact thing that you see on this side is on that side and then it turns 
and it goes all the way in to where we are going to have the vacuum system so it's going to go right over so i was able to get um my 50 feet is like right before probably five or six feet before it goes to the vacuum cleaner is where my chameleon is going to end okay just to let you guys know and they do have a special plate in there a restrictor plate that you put in so your chameleon cannot get sucked you know all the way in um i don't know if i'm going to put mine in or not um just because i um have uh openings and stuff and i don't think i'm gonna have that but you should install that because they do recommend it and then uh, yeah then i ran it over there then it runs in the other room all right that's what we got on the installation so you guys can see i didn't really get to show you guys me gluing it but i am explaining to you the installation so it is you know very simple it's gluing pipe i mean if you don't know how to glue pvc pipe you shouldn't be doing anything you know what i mean like if you don't know the basics of plumbing or electric then then just hire someone to do it don't do it yourself you're just going to cause probably a big headache and it, it just won't be good you know what i mean you need to have like um at least confidence in yourself that you could do it because you can get hurt i've gotten electrocuted a couple of times and let me tell you it's crazy That'd be it for glenn velvet reviews on i guess this part of the install so you guys can see where i'm at how's it going and how you can expect yours to be going it might go a little bit different but you know what i mean at least this is for everyone to learn and get the just of it together as a community all right, so that's it for Glenn Velvet Reviews on this part, on, you know, me showing you what's up. That's where the hole is, obviously, of the central vacuum of the chameleon that I'm installing and, you know, going through with you guys. If you have any questions or comments, please post them down below. I would love to know. Also, subscribe to my channel. Join me on my review adventures as I try to put up stuff to help out the community just like I get help from the community, all right? Um, you can show support to the channel, which would be appreciated, obviously, if you like and subscribe, but also if I have any Amazon affiliate links, if you click them, they do support the channel a very, very small amount. But um, if we ever get up there, then you are gonna, gonna help. And also, I would want you to come back and check on your support that you did give to the channel and make sure that I am putting it back into the channel. Thank you everyone for watching. That's it. I'm pretty much out. Bye-bye. Be safe.